I think something quite remarkable so far already is the fact that we have actually managed to stay alive so long as a independent kingdom surrounded by nothing but enemies but we're watching one of our major enemies to the north there currently fighting huge crusader armies he's beating them all um let's become gregarious can Good. But the Crusader hosts, as we have experienced ourselves, can be quite inexhaustible. And there we go. Now he's now he's losing. 40,000 Crusaders. We have a new heir. Mamigon. That's a neat name. I like it. But they're still standing their ground. Look at that. That is a battle for the ages. They're actually defeating the Crusaders crazy so are you good at anything well you're not sickly so that's decent only we get to decide who you marry the crusaders are actually losing no no they're turning the tide oh wow what a fight Okay, how many troops you got left now? 6,000. That was quick. That was real quick. Are we a threat now? I mean, if our ally joins us... There's his 6,000 moving around. If we can see them getting beaten once more. Quite possible. A whole lot of crusading going on here. Come on crusaders, you can do it. Yes, amass all your troops and slaughter the Muslims. Slaughter them, I say. Looking pretty good. So he has 5,000 troops now. But I feel very confident in the fact that we can now go ahead and let's see. The Jour claim. No, all of these are way too small. We're going to go for a holy war. He can't fight two holy wars. Really can't. We could take the coastline, or we could take something more like that. Dessa, no. Beat Mesopotamia. No, I think we're going to go for the heartland. With Anatolia. That's going to be a really, really, really bad decision, but I still want to make it. Let us consciously make a really, really bad decision. Call in our ally here. Raise our absolutely insufficient troops. Move them all together. The thing I'm banking on here is both our allies and the Crusaders constantly rolling over their army as the enemy arrives to defend. And the other Muslim rulers not really willing to join in a war right now. Another war, that is. So we will go straight for the jugular. As it were. As you can see, his armies are being beaten again. There's just crusaders swarming everywhere right now. Not going to have a chance to defend. Our ally is joined. Let's send our ally right next to us if they survive their own little war that they're having there I 
Can you please step off my head? They were just going to speed through this. There's no way they're going to defend against us. They are being joined by others. But as I said, with all the roaming crusader armies, all the Muslim armies that might join them. Ah, they were victorious. <laughs> okay. That was I mean, it was a bad decision. It really was, but turned out it wasn't too bad. Okay, let's see. Can we get something going between us? Orange? No? Patrol them, maybe? I have an air here. You have nothing. Alright. We have a non aggression pack? No. We are sure carrying a fierce little soldier. We might get stressed, but that's it. We've lost the Cassus belly here. That's okay. So they are weakened right now, as it stands. They are quite weakened. So we can do a standard war. A jour claim for, let's say, Odessa. To complete our little set here. Let's do that. We'll still call in an ally. Uh, not... Her. We just called in her. Let's call in him. This is way too much speed, by the way. Way too much speed. A new heir. So that's, of course, one of the downturns of Ultimo Genitura. You're going to have a whole bunch of new heirs and you never really know who to give what land but fine there is his army have our ally attach if they ever arrive The fight that's going to happen here is going to be these guys, not these guys. That's alright. And they're actually fighting Jerusalem over here for whatever reason. We're going to join and maybe get a little bit of war score out of it. Immediately move over there. Didn't get a war score out of it. Okay. Okay. Who are you fighting? Oh, a bunch of people, not just us. So our allies have joined. All is good, we're just gonna wait for our war to be done. We'll just siege this down until we have it. The siege defenders are doing really well and killing our men. Oh! The Sword of Muhammad has been added to our treasury. Well, if that's not going to be something good, I don't know. Sword of Muhammad, quality 4, that's... That's strong. Plus 3 martial. Yeah. That's crazy. Can't wear it. Because we are not a Muslim practitioner.
some of these also go away way too quickly. If you play on a high speed. That's really not sensible to do. And we are with child again. Our heir gains two marshal. Our little warrior. Struggle as well. Give him a gift and see if he counts for this. No, apparently he is not a Mongol with 60 plus opinion of us. Yeah, let's get some sympathy for the Asdan religion. Um. Yeah, what's that? What is that huge big blob? Where is that from? Why is that here? Right. Okay, we need to call in our ally. Nothing to be done about it. Oh, Georgia has been growing a little bit but they're also muslim all of a sudden so we need some um the mercenary it looks like bulgarian band is back to strength so we'll walk them around a little bit so they have a little bit of morale for joining us who declared war on us you Are you joking? Okay, we need to send them like this. Very unfortunate events. We might not win this one. We'll try, but we might not. Ah, oh, we did. Lovely. And we took a good hostage there as well. Good few hostages. We'll just keep these together. We can sustain this a little bit. But we will. We keep the mercenaries. Until our allies arrive from the north. Okay, now we going to... Split the mercenaries out. Where are the mercenaries? Liege levy, liege levy, liege levy. Bulgarian band, there they are. Let's just get the Bulgarian band in one army. Get them a bunch of good rulers, leaders. And attack this silliness here. While this army calls for the others to attach. So that's what we're going to do. Wait, didn't we have a siege, dude? No. That was in the long before. Each here. Bit more overview of what's going on anyway. Right, let's end this before more people join it. And before we stand these down, let's check how many troops he has. 8,000. Did I see that correctly? Okay, let's let's try something. I've never tried this. So we have 4,000 costing us 24 gold. But we can split these and individually stand them down. 
to get him to stand down a piece of them. So now they cost less. Okay. You can basically dynamically pick and choose how large the mercenary force that you hire should be. So you also control the cost of it. That's not bad. That is not bad one bit. So... They're going to be locked in in six days. Let's bait them into it. Yep, now we need to join quickly, quickly, quickly. Move! Move quick, clear. That was way too close. Way too close for comfort. Yes. Good. And we won. We've taken that. Alright. And we have gotten the not so little Armenia. Uh, first one is fully complete. Second one we're working on. The second one just nine more years until we get this. And then we somehow need to deal with the Mongols in some way or shape, way, shape or form. We have so far unlocked the wizard spear and the page boy. We need another 10 points for the chaperon. Okay. Good, and we have a non-aggression pack with some count somewhere. Where? Down there. Okay. So Georgia, hey? Ah. Uh, Prince of Georgia for our daughter. Sounds good to me. Oh. Infidels. But maybe him. Matrilineal too? No. Just a small little alliance again. And we stand down our armies again. It's actually quite preferable sometimes to have alliances. We need to wait another three years until we can revoke for religious reasons. Which we're definitely going to do once we can. Right, we're not going to put our best leaders to be our marshal. It's going to be this guy who's sort of okay. Oh! Anatolia. You want to patrol them now, maybe? You got something for me? Where's my daughter in all this? Ah, I just patrolled her. Alright, though. My uncle and my cousin. Yeah, that's not at all weird. But we'll totally do it. Do it. Don't want an alliance. Let me give you a gift, so you might be more. Oh, out. Maybe we can not sway her. No. Do you want another patrol ball? Maybe. No. Okay. So what's around us? Let's have a quick look. You're your own thing. What thing are you? You're not a very big thing. We are a bigger thing. All things considered. Um, could do a few border disputes. 
But he's still allied with the Abbasid. Not touching that. You are fairly small. And you do not have any sort of vassal or ally. We could grow a little bit more. Against the Lulu. And there's a whole lot of troops walking around here that are really big. Currently at war with someone already. So we should just wait and watch his war play out a little bit. Maybe he's going to lose a bunch of troops as it is. Maybe not. Sometimes you get these pirate message and stuff, it's just to give you an option or rather sometimes to force alliances to break, which is fairly annoying. Right, so what do we need? We need tolerance. Get higher status for women. That's what we want. We want full status of women. We're going to save up our points there. And we're going to give up our pride. Keep the alliance going. All good then, indeed. Yes, Egypt would like to have a proper alliance, and we will agree wholeheartedly to that idea. Wholeheartedly. Five thousand. Yes, more from vassals than he should have. Interesting. We've got some gold here. The Georgian revolt to do what? You once claim Georgia. Yeah, all right. How many troops this kid got? Six thousand. How many troops you got? Okay, sounds all right. We're going to send our own troops. Not our levy troops. They get a little bit upset about this when I try to make them do it. Ah, they need support quickly. So we're going to send the first batch immediately and the rest kind of follows. Question is, can they support this? Yes. And Need to help our queens. Uh, stop it. That's what happens if you just let it run too long. Things go wrong. Move a part of our army over there. We don't get it. Shouldn't. Plus we might get a little bit of gold out of it. Okay, his army is down there. Doing nothing much. Give them some leader. We're pregnant again. Yes, we will join your war near Egypt. Just that we don't have any troops and Okay, they're likely going to attack us here. How many troops we got? 2,500. So we kinda need them to join us. 
in this fight. Another man in charge here. I'm pretty sure they're going to attack us here, so we're just going to punch up a bit. To deter their idea of conquest. The man is still in prison and he's still alive. Oh, what's that? What's going on here? Six thousand. That's more than six thousand I'm looking at here. Really need to build things. I think it's time to build another castle. No, it really isn't Not yet. Anyway, castle town is up. Get some more barracks. I feel like getting mercenaries involved. But also kind of not. And we have another daughter. Lovely. See if we can't do something here now. My sweet, lovely, beautiful daughter. Take her. What? For the other kid? No. Bad or what? Did we create a bad kid? Oh yeah, she's a giant. That's not ideal. She might become more attractive as a marriage prospect as she grows older. But for now, she's not all that interesting, I understand. I don't like what's going on here. Could send some more troops. I think I should. Get our levies involved. How has our alliance broken down? That's so unfair. We're just doing so well. We get an alliance up again? Yeah, we can. Oh, they're even of my dynasty. So let's get the depressed one. <laughs> no. I mean, sure, why not?
Always break the betrothal again. Must go siege their capital. That is how to win this. Yes, more tolerance. I really want to push this, but I kind of need this, so... We're going to go for this for now. So we can revoke this. Only vessels will reject. Let's just spy on him. I'm sure he'll do something. Allowing us to imprison him. Oh no, we need our... Our ally needs our help. And we will be too late. My patriarch. Sure, I mean, he cut our father's head off. Let's totally make a move on that man. That sounds... Sounds like a fantastic idea. I don't see anything going wrong with that. Are our commanders in place? Not really. Sort of now. Oh, they just multiplied out of nothing. Did you see that? The number just jumped up. No idea. Well, I suppose we're out of this war now. After having suffered several useless losses. There we go. Oh no, our retinue's being killed. Quite slaughtered. Send them up to the other Christian land there to sit them around. Why is this suddenly... Why are there so many on, on, on their side all of a sudden? Can you stop attacking me? Are, are you kidding? You silly raiders. Well, now I don't have retinue anymore, so I don't have to worry about them either. But that's okay. Both. Yes, we will expose and denounce him. So we can arrest him. Sounds good to me. Quite good. Indeed. And we need to take care of our port here. Keeper of Swans. This guy, and this guy, we revoke his title. Oh no, we can imprison him, not revoke. You know what? I don't, I don't care. Let's revoke. I don't care what Sunni vassals think of us. Ah, yeah. Oh, okay, we'll deal with this next time.